Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to remove old network connections in Windows Vista. Let's go to our computer. And what we're going to do is go to the control panel. So let's click on the start button. And in the little search area here, I'm going to type control panel. Now what I get is a link to the control panel up here under programs. Let's just click that. Make sure we're in the classic view by clicking on classic view. And what we want to find here is the network center within the control panel, the network and sharing center. Just double click on that. Now this shows you all of the network connections that you currently have active. And over here on the left, it gives you options to control those connections. So let's just click on manage network connections. And what you're going to see here is your list of network connections. I have three here, and one of them I don't need anymore. It's an old connection to my work, and I just don't need it anymore. These other two is local area connection. We want to leave that because that is the plug, basically, that's on our computer. And the wireless network connection, we also want to leave that one because that's our wireless uh, internet connection that I'm currently using. So if I want to delete the one for work, which I don't need anymore, I'll just right click on it. I'm going to select delete. It's going to confirm that I want to delete that connection and I'll just say yes. So now work will no longer show up as an existing network connection that I can connect to when I'm trying to open the internet or things like that. It's good to clean out this list every now and then if you have a whole lot of network connections on your computer. My name is Dave Andrews and I've just showed you how to delete a network connection in Windows Vista.